is this space here. And you can see it is an incomplete egg. We have left out this bottom part. Now we're going to put big curves on the side, like this, coming from our end. Put one on the left and one on the right. Now all we have to do is connect these two lines with little curves on the bottom, like so. One little curve, two little curves, three little curves, however works out for you. Now, if yours doesn't look exactly like this, that's fine, because it's your class. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to take all of the left side of these curves and create shadows to give it some depth. We'll start here, and you'll see we'll just make little hash marks like that. Do the same thing over here, over here, over here. And you see what I'm doing is I'm starting by making longer lines and then making shorter lines, giving it that curvy shape. And if you want to be tricky, you can even put a little T right in here, a little curved line. And again, do the shading. And voila, we have a cloud. And if you want an extra treat for your cloud, why not give it a lightning bolt? And a lightning bolt is pretty easy to draw also. Draw down to the left, drop down to the left, and down. And then a little bit to the right, do the same thing. Go down to the left, down to the left, and down, but meet at the same point. Then what you can do is put a line down the center, like thus, and make little hash marks on half the lightning bolt. Why not? Now there are dozens 